I wasn't on the Brooklyn Bridge yesterday. I wasn't in New York City. I wasn't even in the United States. But yesterday I came home from work and turned on the television to the BBC World News uh, to find out what was going on in the world. Well, the top story, to which they paid an awful lot of attention, was some sort of a disturbance that took place with some mass arrests on the Brooklyn Bridge involving um, some people that were uh, affiliated or um, at least self-affiliated to the Occupy Wall Street movement. As I say, I wasn't there, so I don't really know what happened. I don't know whose fault it all was. I don't know who uh, caused the trouble. I don't know uh, whether it was the police or whether, whether it was, was the marchers. I'm inclined to think that it was the police that did it, but again, I wasn't there, so I don't know. Um, one thing that I will say, though, is that the police, by design or otherwise, have given the movement a gigantic shot in the arm. The world now knows all about Occupy Wall Street. It's front page news all over the world. Thank you, NYPD. Oh, and a word to the uh, people who actually are supporting this, especially people in New York. I think you know this already, but uh, I'll just reiterate what I'm sure you know and I'm sure a lot of other people are saying. You've got the moral high ground. If I were you, I'd avoid people like the Black Bloc and the people who tend to riot and smash things just for fun. Publicly disavowing them won't do you any harm either. Keep up the good work. Thank you.